intergenerational cares are coming together um, of younger and older people for a very specific purpose. So it's not just having a visit or having a read or having a making pancakes. It is actually according to a specific curriculum and it's putting young and old people together uh, for a very specific purpose and that purpose is learning from one another. Trying to do with our research is to create a sustainable business model when it comes to intergenerational care. At this point in time, internationally, intergenerational care programs are operating successfully. However, they're underpinned by predominantly a very strong government funding or a research grant funding. And what we're finding, particularly in the United States, is that a lot of these programs are actually shutting down because there is no ongoing sustainability when it comes to the economic um, feasibility of the program. So that's why in our program, we focus on education, workforce, and sustainability in the sense of what's the economic feasibility of the program as well as what's the program evaluation in general. The overarching goal is learning from one another. Then the sub goals, if you like, or the sub um, sections underneath that could be the specific context in which that happens. It needs to be developmental, developmental for children, developmental for older people, developmental for the staff, developmental for society as a whole, and it needs to become the norm. Intergenerational care has some really exciting possibilities when it comes to the future of both the aged care and the childcare workforce. What we're also trying to look at is how much value does an intergenerational care program add to attracting employees or future employees to both the childcare and the aged care set is what are the career opportunities that could actually exist and extend some of the career models between the aged care and the childcare um, populations when it comes to the workforce. And we're really hoping that the retention and turnover of those workforces will actually improve um, as a result. For example, uh, from my perspective as, as a health economist, looking at, well, are there cost savings associated with this in terms of the running of the centres and the blending of, of those um, two care environments? Where we go from here is um, we are collecting um, data with integrity that um, others can use for the development of their own um, intergenerational learning programs.